on our team all over the country and soon to be all around the world as well. A chance to give out recognition for all new reps and a chance for us just to have camaraderie and meet each other and get to know each other. Tonight the call is going to be open. I'm going to bring up on the line right now is top producing national sales executive out of Chicago, Ms. Lou Smith. So Lou, are you there? Yes, I am. Thank you so much, Mr. Brandon Ivy. I have thanks for the wonderful introduction. I took my hat and give it back to you. And for all that you do in our Rachel family. But um guys, are we excited tonight? This is our opportunity, uh, once a week. We actually uh you know, just get to bond with each other. So, you know, I look forward to this every single every Sunday. Uh, and doing that, what I'd like to do is I'd like to introduce new reps. Are there any new reps that have gotten started in the last week, or even the last two weeks? If so, go ahead and state your name, your city that you're representing, as well as your sponsor. Any new reps? Any new reps? A lot of people make money this past week, so I know there's new reps. Hey, Mommy, Philadelphia, I just started two weeks ago. Awesome. Welcome. This is the uh, applied manager. Welcome. Welcome to our Vitale family. Uh, anyone else? So if there's anyone, maybe they're not on the line, but you've sponsored someone uh, that's on your team, and you'd like to introduce them to the team? Hey, Lou, this is Herb. I'm a Texas County Texas. I have two new team members. Uh, one, Mark Reader, driving me. She's just and Henry about a week ago. Okay, what city are they at? Uh, one's in Texas, Texas, and one's in Texas. Well, nice, okay. Well, welcome them, welcome them to our family. Anyone else? Yes, I have two new team members this week. Uh, my first one is international from New Zealand. Hi, who are you? I'm in the green and the Denver, Colorado. Okay, uh, and what's the name? Oh, my first name is Andrew Flanagan. He is in New Zealand. And my second new rep of the week, his name is George Lane, and he's also from Denver, Colorado. Nice, New Zealand in the house. Excellent. Well, congratulations. Congratulations, and welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, is there anyone else? Any new reps that we should Hi. Hey, Lou. This is Penny. Wait, one second, Penny. Oh, Was the gentleman speaking? Yes, hi, Lou. Hey, can you hear me? This is Chris. Okay. Oh, hey, Chris. You sound far away. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, uh, yeah, let's go. Um, welcome, Armand. Anybody that has anything to do with 
You have my business page and free cell phone service. Woohoo! Good job! Okay, congratulations. Anyone else? This is Vicki in Indiana. I've got my free business, free cell phone, free VPN. Hi, nice, nice, nice. Congratulations, Miss Vicki. Anybody else? Anybody else relieving a little stress? Brandon Ivy, I have my business, cell phone, internet, cable, electricity, and car phone. Congrats, congrats. Very good present. Who else is, who, who else? Who else is really a little financial stress? <laughs> uh, Michael Smith here. Uh, cell phone, internet, cable, um, what is it? Uh, electricity, and car phones. Nice. Congratulations. Congratulations. That's it. Anybody else? Anybody else get their bills paid or have gotten their bills paid by Vital? This is Lydia Bois. I have my business paid. I've recently earned another bill just waiting for collecting which one's going to be. Congratulations. And you won a thousand dollars. Nice! Congratulations, congratulations! Uh, Chris? This is Chris, Chris, Wow! So all of your bills plus the $750 cash to do whatever you want to with it. Not a bad day. <laughs> Who else? Who else is getting their bills paid or have gotten their bills paid by Vital? Richard Wesley, New Jersey. Yeah, all my bills are in the 750 car bonus. Kim Plessif. Very impressive. Congratulations to you. Uh, very, very impressive. So I really I took my hat to you guys. Um, I mean, just being able to conquer the Freedom Club Challenge, you know, put it such uh, annually, puts another $15,000, you know, in your pocket, basically, from your job that you know longer have to spend out on deals. Uh, so you're, it's a $15,000 savings. So very excited about you guys conquering the challenge. Uh, anybody else? Anybody else getting their, their business paid free? Anybody else get in there? Or Jane, I get my business for my cell phone free. Congratulations. Congratulations. Anybody else? I don't want to omit anybody. This is Penny Kyle. I have a. Now, I have a teammate, Veronica Hart, out of Texas. Is the only one in my downline that won her hundred dollars for having a diamond fully qualified. Nice! Oh my that hundred dollars. I'll tell you what. <laughs> it comes in handy. Uh, and uh, Miss Kitty is talking about the uh, team qualifier bonus. Remember, as a diamond member. There's so much more money on the table. Whenever you get a personally sponsored rep, whenever you help them, they get qualified, whether it's 300 in CV, uh, you get a $100, a one-time $100 bonus goes to you. And it doesn't matter when they do it. Whenever they get it done, whether it be two weeks, a month, two months, three months, whenever they get that done, a $100 will trickle up to you. Uh, you know, if you're a diamond member, you're a diamond member. So that is awesome, awesome, awesome. That is nice. That's money that uh, we don't even count that. It just kind of comes in. We're like, wow. Okay. <laughs> um, so that is very, very impressive. Anybody else getting bills paid? Anybody else getting their bills paid? Let me move right along. Are there any uh, $1,000 winners? On the line, has anyone referred three diamond power packs and earned a thousand dollars in Rocket Oak? Wow, how many times did you hit it, Chris? 
time. It's just what we choose, you know, to do with our time. Open your mouth. <laughs> Share the opportunity. Should I talk to the background? Go ahead and start six, please. If you're laughing in the background, start six.
I'm sure with you what I do. And I, I, I think there are a couple of, of other leaders that do the same thing. But what I do, I am not a huge customer getter. I'm not. I know what I do. I can build a team. I can, you know, help you guys. I can do all of that. I'm not a, I'm not a huge customer getter. So what I do, and this is a little nugget, but what I do to make sure that the money train does not stop <laughs> or pass me up, what I do is I bless two people with DBS every single month. You know, I have my business paid for it. I'm not paying for that. I bless my mom and I bless my brother with DBS every single month. I call it a hot hundred dollars that I have and, and that I invest in my business to make sure that the money train does not pass me up. There is no way I'm going to rely on a customer paying their PDF for that month or not if that's going to dictate whether I get my residuals beyond my, 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 my uh, level one. You know, whether I get my, all my bills paid free, you know, because I missed because one customer decided not to pay <laughs> for the VBN. So I just go ahead and, and, and I invest a hundred dollars into my business every single month. Now, if you're going to do that, let me share with you how to do that. <laughs> there is a really uh, a proper way to do that. If you are going to bless someone else with VBN, you have to make sure that you use a different email address other than the email address you use for your business. Because everything is tracked with email addresses. So even if you put somebody else's name on CBN, if you use your email address that you use for your business, it's going to register as a member sale, which will not count towards qualify because it has to be a customer sale. Okay, so I hope, let me see if I can open the mic up again. Okay, so I, I hope I'm kind of being very clear on that. Um, you know, don't hear half of it and then conveniently not hear the part where you need to change the email address. <laughs> Because if you don't change the email address, it will show up as a member. Uh, it'll be tracked right back to you as a member with their name on it, and it still won't count as a customer sale. So uh, that's one little tip that I, I want to give you guys. But what I really, really want to talk about is that we're doing some incredible things here uh, at Vitatel with them partnering with uh, Green's Investment Fund. You know, it's almost like a rebirth of Vito, if you will. I mean, we're already an incredible company. But the things that they have, the enhancements that they have to come, I mean, this event, we're having a regional uh, event in Houston, June the 14th and 15th. I'm going to tell you guys, I don't care how you do it, you need to be there. You have not really experienced Vital until you experience a regional event, until you can look the CEO, the COO, until you can look the SVP of marketing, so until you can look them in the eye, face to face, have dialogue, you have really not experience Vital. I mean, I know that we we had um, an event in Atlanta and, and, uh, back in September of last year. We had an event in Atlanta and the people who made it to that event, when they got back to their city, they were entirely different people with an entirely different game plan, and their businesses exploded. As a matter of fact, when I, I'll tell you this, when I was in Atlanta, I was an area sales manager. When I was 
after Atlanta, I was an area sales manager. It put so much fire. It put so much fire. It just ignited something and just, you know, I went to work. So I, I can't, I guarantee you, you know, they buy steal, bunk up, do whatever you have to do, but commit to being at the event in Houston is going to explode your business like nothing else can compare to a regional event. It, it, it just can't. It's, it's from, from my understanding, the area and, and the hotel uh, is gorgeous. The area in itself is supposed to be just, you know, just walk around this, that, and the other. But with the events, there's so much camaraderie going on and so much rainstorming going on. You will literally get no sleep. It's about bonding, you know, with other people. And right now we're kind of meeting each other, you know, on Facebook or what have you. But it's nothing like face to face being able to, to just bounce off ideas. And, and the adrenaline from that, I promise you, your business will explode. Your business will explode. So please, I just encourage you guys to commit to, to going, uh, you, you know, share this with your team members. And, um, and one of the things that, you know, is, is this very important in helping you expose your business. Lastly, I want to talk about the importance of freeway calling. I mean, this three-way call, and listen to me. The importance of the three-way call with your upline leader. You know, those who do three-ways, it's, it's, it's a known fact. The person who does the most three-ways builds the biggest team. And I don't know what it is, uh, but what we're even afraid of, but how well I want you guys to look at, I want you to look at Vital. You know, you should, you should have fun with this. But I want you to look at it as it's a, a dirt game. This is, this is my approach to uh, the business. I look at it each and every day like it's a game of dart. And, you know, before we throw our very first dart, we already know that some are going to miss. Matter of fact, when we first start going, we know that they're not even going to hit the wall. They're just going to, you know, just bounce straight on the floor. <laughs> you know, we really suck at it when we first start throwing darts. But then, we also know that some are going to stick. So the more and more we throw the darts, definitely the less they're going to flop on the floor. As a matter of fact, the more we throw the darts, the closer, you know, we start landing actually on the board, and then as we continue, we get closer and closer to the bullseye. It, it's inevitable that you will hit a bullseye if you can continue to, to throw the darts. So knowing that, just it is a dirt game, it's no big deal, you've heard no before. As a matter of fact, you know, we hear, if, 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 if the question is opposed, you know, the answer is typically yes or it's no. Now, we've heard yes or no for our entire lives. But it's really not until we get in network marketing that we're just so torn about hearing no. <laughs> we've been hearing no our whole lives. So what do we do? We just keep it moving. But not until we get in network marketing is it just such a major, oh my God, they told me no, I'm closing down shop. <laughs> you know, if you can't look, and let, I want you to encourage you to shoot for no. Because the more no's you get, I promise you, your yeses will increase. Just shoot for no, don't even shoot for the yes, shoot for the no. <laughs> and I promise you, by default, your yeses will increase. Um, so that's how I want to, you know, share with you. You know, I'm not going to hold you guys all night. 
<laughs> but definitely have fun with this. You know, take the fear out and have fun with this thing and understand that you guys have something that people need. You know, in a lot of other opportunities, we have a lot of optional stuff going on. You know, try my coffee. Okay, well, what's so good about your coffee versus Starbucks? I mean, we don't have to do that here. When it's there without your prospect's participation in Vitel, what we offer to assist them with the already paying for these items? Everybody you know already has a cell phone. They already have, you know, cable or internet. They already have, uh, you know, if they're eligible for an upgrade, they're going to get an upgrade. Now, not, not until they meet someone like you in your hotel business do they even know that it's an option for them to buy that phone $100 cheaper. They don't know you when you open your mouth. I, think, I guarantee you they would better get the phone anyway. So unless you open your mouth, they, just, they can't get it from you if you don't tell them. But not many people in their right mind would choose to pay $100 more knowingly. You know, so I keep in mind that we have what people need. We're not bugging them. We have, we actually have what they need. I have never really been partnered with a company uh, where I didn't feel like I was bugging somebody, you know, or trying to convince them to purchase something that they wouldn't normally purchase anyway. You know, and that was one of my main attractions in, into uh, Vito. In addition to the fact that they pay your bills. And, you know, I, I had somebody, um, last week I got into a mistake with somebody, and I do want to share this with you guys. Um, somebody told me, they were in another company, and they told me that if they knew, if they had a friend who they knew were in another company, that they would not even approach them with their opportunity. They wouldn't even approach them with their opportunity. So here's the thing. There's a lot of people and a lot of opportunities who are drowning Driving. And we have the life vest. We have the, the vest. So share it with everybody. I don't care what opportunity they're in. It's their own option, you know, to say yes or no, but you don't take that option away from them by not telling them. You would be surprised. Uh, and just how many people just won't share their opportunity because somebody else is already doing something else. You don't know if they're making any money. They could be drowning. And then this comes along and it completely makes sense. The one thing I know about Vito versus any other company that's out there is that Vito is the only company that pays you for allowing them to pay your bills as you're building your business. So it takes the same amount of energy to build any company that you partner with. It'll take the same amount of energy if you're really uh, working it and, and, and trying to build it. So why wouldn't a person want to get their bills paid as they're doing it? It's really a no but they don't know that unless you share that with them. So with that, and I don't, Brandon, did you have anything you wanted to add to the conversation? No, I don't. Okay, so with that, guys, uh, definitely, and my last thing I want to share with you guys, every single night, Monday through Friday, we have opportunities to help you guys build your vital businesses. There are live webinars going on Monday through Friday and Saturday, a Sunday evening. Please support the webinars and bring your guests. This is the easiest way for you to build your business in a big time way, you know, so that you don't even have to budget up. All you're doing
doing is inviting people to the live webinars and allowing the leaders to close them out for you. You really can't get any simpler than that. Uh, so I do want to see the numbers increase. I want to see you guys really, really pound and pave that. Um, you know, let's really make an impact. When we go to Houston, I want each and every one of you guys to be recognized and walking across that stage. And you can do it. So in the next two months, in the next two months, let's go hard. Let's go hard. So what is that? That's all I have for you guys tonight. So uh, I love you guys, and I look forward to, uh, you know, seeing you guys at the top. Have a great night.